And speaking of local nonprofits, while many Chattanoogans may fa have fall on their minds, one nonprofit already thinking about the winter time. Its founder says he truly loves the city's homeless population. He encourages others to love them as well. News Tour's Jordan Simmel has more on this uplifting story. He joins us now live in the studio. Jordan. Andrew, good evening. Thank you. The volunteers behind Pawpaw's Homeless Ministry have been working to bring, bring hope to the city's homeless population since 2019. When someone asked founder Mike Rice what they should call him, his granddaughter simply answered Pawpaw, and that name has stuck ever since. Ministry volunteers gathered Tuesday afternoon to separate and box winter clothes for Chattanooga's growing homeless population. Rice says this drive happens about twice every year. We have to accumulate all the clothes from people that donate it, and we have to keep it up to date. We're getting ready already for our Thanksgiving, and that is to distribute all the clothes to the homeless on 11th Street, box it up, and usually we end up with about 200 boxes by the time we leave. Since the ministry began, Rice and his team have prepared more than 34,000 meals to homeless Chattanoogans, as well as provided blankets, tents, clothing, and more. Rice says this work, which may take up to 60 hours of his week, is something done with spirits. He and his assistant Donna Adkins believe this is God's mission for them. You just go with your heart, your soul. These people become our family. Mm -hmm. These people become our friends. And we begin to worry if we don't see them. And so it, it's a true calling. Rice says the homeless community on 11th Street has grown 154% since last year and encourages residents to look on them with kindness. The man they call Pawpaw says Chattanooga's homeless just need to be loved. Volunteering just once, he says, blesses your hearts. They're just bad on their luck, down on their luck. And people have no clue what a percentage of the homeless people actually have jobs, but there's no affordable living for them. That's what God says to take care of one another, feed the hungry, feed the ones that need help, and that's what we do. Now, Pawpaw has more than 14 fridges and freezers packed with donated food to feed those in need. Local Chick-fil-A's in particular have donated plenty of chicken and biscuits. If you want to donate funds, food, or goods to the nonprofit as well, more information can be found on Pawpaw's Homeless Ministries Facebook page. Live from the studio, Jordan Simmel, News 12.